Hi. Um, I'm sitting sort of awkwardly like this because uh, I wanted to show off my pantone wall. I think it's pretty. I'm like super tired. I have not recovered from London. Like I just, my tiredness is just keep going full force. So still tired. I went to class on Wednesday. I really didn't need to. Um, we were doing InDesign in class and I was like, oh great, I love InDesign. This will be fun. We started off with, these are the tools. This is how you draw a square. Oh, it was so boring. And I don't know why I have such guilt about not going to class. Um, so I stayed all day. It was slightly painful. Anyways, I went to class on Thursday and we had an interview with the people for our project. And it went really well, even though, I, well, I assume it went well. It was in Danish, so I assume it went well. A lot of talking occurred, so, eh. And on Thursday night, I went to a party at the House of Love, which is another um, Kia accommodation um, where a lot of the Spanish students live. I went because one of my friends wanted me to and I pretty much say yes to most things because I feel like life is more interesting that way, but sometimes it doesn't work out. I only stayed for an hour and a half. Um, <laughs> it was sort of half Spanish people, half architecture students, and I did not really fit into either of those groups. So I kind of just stood there for an hour and a half. But Friday and Saturday made up for that. Um, the farmer's market was really good and I ate a really good cinnamony thing and it, oh, it was so good. And we walked around, we walked around downtown and it was, it was nice. And then on Saturday night, I was gonna go out, but didn't happen. I just stayed home and talked to Kirsten for like three hours, <laughs> but it was great. We did New Jersey accents, we had, <laughs> we made a Cake Boss episode. It was sort of like a major inside joke, but oh my god, it was so funny. I don't think anyone was here hopefully in my apartment because they probably thought I was mental, but mm. They're not, they're not far off. <laughs> oh yeah, and we also discussed the fact I posted my um, dancing in London video. Got a lot more attention than I thought it would. I just, there's a lot of things I post on my wall and no one says anything and I tag Kirsten and Aaron in it and they're like, oh, that was funny. Um, but usually no one else says anything. And this time, it was a lot different. Um, Oh, what happened? It's been a day since it's up and it's already had like 80 views and I'm like, who is watching this? Who is watching this? <laughs> and I'd like to know that it is not a good depiction of my dance abilities. Um, <laughs> dancing in public is really weird, so you, <laughs> you try to keep it as subtle as possible. But I said, as I said, I was going to do it in more than one country, so I will up the ante for the next country I go to. I'll have like full on choreography, it'll be great. So that's what's happened. And today, I've just been kind of having a lazy day. And I'm gonna, I'm actually, well, I'm gonna film something right now. Um, I am a workaholic. I have discovered this. I didn't think I liked working as much as I do, but um, since the workload in school here is not as bad as it is <laughs> at home, um, I've been like doing a lot more stuff that I haven't been able to do. Yeah, which is really great. And I've been blogging and blogging and all that jazz a lot more, which I like it. I like it. So, I'm gonna go do that now. <laughs>